Hello again, speaking to you today from the Liberty Boat Garden in Port Soy. And I think this is fast becoming one of my favourite places in the town to come and spend a peaceful hour or so. Not that it's always all that quiet, there's the ever present sound of the seagulls overhead usually, and they're quite quiet today, but there's birds tweeting and at this time of year, and if the weather's as nice as it is today, there's always the noise, and it's a nice noise though of people splashing about in the harbour down below. And I think I like it best here because it's such a sheltered spot, unless the wind's blown from the west that is, and in the early evenings, again on days like this, well it's a real sun trap. We all need a place to go for some peace and quiet. Jesus did. We can read about it in the Gospel of Mark, chapter 1, verses 35 to 37. Very early in the morning, long before daylight, Jesus got up and left the house. He went out of the town to a lonely place where he prayed. But Simon and his companions went out searching for them, and when they found him, they said, Everyone's looking for you. Do you know, there are lots of things that take priority in our lives, I think. Maybe it's a film or a TV programme we've been waiting to see. It might be a holiday or maybe it's an event or a concert that we want to go to. Not that that's been happening too much over the past year and a half, right enough. Maybe it's a shopping trip for essentials or just for some retail therapy. And sometimes, well, less pleasant things take priority, like an illness or a tragedy in our lives. But whatever our priorities, I think, it does us good to get away to a quiet place every so often, a place like this. Jesus used this time to pray and we can do that too, that, that'll certainly do us good. But what's most important is that we simply take time or make time every day to recharge our batteries. And we do that by being alone with our thoughts, by being alone with God. And that's just what I'm going to do now. I might be here for a while.